my name is Francine Milford. I am a licensed massage therapist, personal trainer, and owner of the Tuning Fork Therapy website. As you can see today, I am going to demonstrate how you can make yourself a nice little tuning fork apron. What you need is when you order any kind of tuning fork set from me, a large set, you'll be given uh, your set in a nice case. Take that case and fold the flap over and now this is going to be the line that you're going to work with. What you have to do then is go down and buy yourself some ribbon. You can get some thin ones, but I like the very large ones and you can even get larger than this if you want. And you have to decide the length. Do you want to tie the ribbon around once and tie it in the back? Or like what I prefer doing is taking it to the back, wrap it around back and the front, and tying it. And I'll demonstrate that for you in a moment. So you go down, you buy your ribbon. What you're going to do is on that crease, you're going to stitch that ribbon right in half, right over it. So it looks like this. Here's your ribbon. You're going to take it half over one side, half over the other, and do a little stitch. Now, if you don't have a sewing machine or and you don't have a needle and thread, they actually sell a felt now that is like a stick. It's like a little tape. And you can just tape it on both sides and stick it right onto it. Now, I don't know how well that's going to hold up, but I'm just saying if you can't do it yourself or get your mom or grandma to do it for you, then that is an option. So anyway, you're going to sew that on the side, and then you're going to flip it back over, and there's your apron. I'm going to show you what it looks like on. So I take it like this, and I put it in the front. I wrap it around the back. And then I tie it. Now this will stay in place the whole time I'm working. Then I can do my tuning forks and use them. And I have them all lined up from C to C so I know where they're at as I'm going along. When I'm all done, I just take it off, put it down. And then what I like to do is... I like to put the straps inside, fold it over, and then I like to roll my forks up. You can also buy some small ribbon, stitch it to the outside with just a couple little stitches, it only takes seconds, and then I use that as my tie to hold it in place. So now I tie it, I put in a little bow because I love little bows. And now my tuning forks are safe, they're in a secure place, they're not banging into each other, and now I can travel with them. So if you're going to travel, this is like great, it doesn't take up much space as you can see, easy to get at. I just love it, and I hope you do too. Thanks for watching, and visit me at my website at www.tuningforktherapy.com for some other great ideas, tips, and I have tons of articles. Um, that uh, doctors are using tuning forks uh, to on the body. It's just amazing what's coming up now as more and more people are working with tuning forks and sound therapy. And I'm glad that you're going to be one of them. Have a great day. Namaste.